Now let's bring in Kathy Stewart Onan, the mayor of Mayfield and the city's fire chief, Jeremy Creason. Good morning to you both. Thank you so much for taking the time. I know you've been working around the clock. We do appreciate it. Uh, mayor, I want to start with you because the two of us spoke last night and you've had a little bit more time now to assess the devastation. What is the situation right now in terms of damage, recovery and lives lost? The streets are clear. Um, and so our emergency vehicle, vehicles are able to get where they need to be right now. Uh, damage, there were already people out uh, removing debris from their property yesterday afternoon. Yeah, streets might be clear, but we can see the devastation right behind you there. Chief yeah. Creason, I want to talk to you here because what can you tell us now about the search and rescue efforts for possible survivors, especially in that candle factory where dozens are still unaccounted for? And at what point do you have to make that difficult call to then move to a recovery mission? The, uh, the candle factory is a very complicated uh, rescue situation uh, and, and so it, it takes a lot of time. We've got a lot of heavy equipment, a lot of personnel. Uh, we're dealing with tons of steel and metal that's uh, twisted and mangled and uh, uh, chemicals and, and uh, there's just a lot going on on that uh, scene. Chief Creason, you've been speaking to us as a public official, but for a moment, speak to us from the heart because you represent this small town, about 10,000 people. Uh, your rescuers live in this community. These, these are your friends. These are your neighbors, your loved ones, the people who are hurting and suffering right now. How are you and your team holding up through this tragedy? Uh, you know, th this is one of the most uh, Difficult situations that that I'll probably that that we'll we'll probably ever face in our life, but it, it's just uh, it, it, th this is going to leave a mark on our community. Uh, and, but you know we will rebuild, we'll bounce back. Uh, we I have a, a very resilient group of uh, first responders that 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 I, I get the pleasure to to serve with every day, and, and I couldn't be more proud of them. And uh, over the next month, few months and years, um, uh, you're going to see our community uh, do the same thing. We'll bounce back. We'll come back stronger than we were uh, before. Well, we are inspired by that resilience, and we are thinking about uh, you, your entire team, and everyone hurt by this tragedy. Thank you again, Mayor and Chief, for your time this morning. We do appreciate it. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.